Hey guys, it's Face Devon. I'm here from Redding Productions, and today I'm going to show you how to create an animated watermark on your videos, like you should be seeing, and something like that. The Redding Production logo flashes, and it's basically animated. I just made a simple animation so that it's easy to render out. So let's start right away. So I have this transparent GIF file <coughs> there. It's just a little, you know. If you want to see how to create transparent GA files, just comment and I will make a video to show you. And once you have your animated GA file completed, you have to download the file in the description. And it will be a software called uh, this uh, Moya Flash Video MX Pro. Okay. Once you install it and uh, do whatever is written in the description in the description in the file, you can open this up and click on Add Files and choose whatever. I made this sample video to show you. It's a 10 second long video. Me, to, you know, rotating the cursor here and there. And for the watermark, go into the watermark tab. Click on this Add Image and then select the image you want uh... this one is what i want so click on open and if you play it you can actually see a preview but it comes on the top left so change that from top left to top right and maybe change that to minus three fifty so it's kind of in the center okay and it's really small you can see it's, it is there but it's really small so i'm just gonna increase the size a bit maybe to three hundred and the aspect ratio make sure it's preserved otherwise you'll lose everything and yeah that, that looks good and then when you're satisfied click on stop and click on next now here you want to select the fr frame rate to original and the video codec to S2.264 and untick this generate flash and you gotta click on next and it will export it to your documents moya flash and one dot FLV. Now, uh, when you're done, just click on start and let it render. It takes some time depending on the length of your video and the complexity of your watermark. But uh, I'm just gonna wait till it renders. By the time I'll open up, uh, I'm sorry, my documents, documents, Moya Flash, and uh, which one was that? Number one. Okay, so. Uh, these are the ones, number one, and I'm just going to delete both of them because they're not used. Don't delete that one because it's the raw file. So you can see it's almost done, and uh, I closed my documents, so I'm going to open that up again. Okay, and there you go. Actually, it opens up automatically, so you don't need to do that. There you go, you have your FLV file here. I'm sorry. Now the problem is you cannot upload an FLV file to YouTube. So how to do that? There's another software which is in the download link. It's a free one called Pozera FLV to AVI Converter. And what you want to do is click on Add Files, navigate to the folder My Documents Moya Flash, and select the FLV file. Then you want to change this to H264 slash MPEG and select AVI and then in the output directory I've selected desktop to show you and then when you're done just click on this convert button and let it convert to AVI again I'm gonna wait till it converts um, there you go you have your raw file here and then I'm gonna show you how it actually looks it will look similar to that one well, let's wait um, come on, come on, come on, come on. Yeah, I got my new PC, so I love to boost. You'll click on this close, and this close it again. And there you have your file. It will be HD, I suppose, because it's 30 frames per second. Now you can see that logo it is flashing there. Similarly, you can cre create other logos, but make sure don't make it too complex. Otherwise, um, because GAFs don't handle color really well, so you should you would be having problems and make sure to download the final description hope you enjoyed the video please comment rate and subscribe